Good morning, guys. Welcome to another RC vlog. You guys really, really love these these videos, and I will do more of them. I will continue to do them when I can. So the battery is currently charging, so we are just waiting for that. But we also have some huge updates involving the RCs and stuff. Yester in yesterday's vlog, if you haven't seen yesterday's vlog, which is awesome, go go watch it. Link in the description. Top link will take you right there. I said that if the video got 10 likes, I would get drift tires and use them. Well, the video has been up for not even an hour and a half, and it's already almost gotten its light goal. So, I bought the, I bought the drift tires. And we're going to use them today. So, yeah. So, I went to the hobby store yesterday, bought some drift tires. And hopefully we can have some fun with them today. And I, I tried them last night. They are fantastic. They are fun. You don't get as, you don't. It's not about speed. Uh, the other tires I have, the white ones, are for speed, for racing. And then the other ones, the drifting ones, you don't go fast. You just... Very, very slow. But fun. So, in a bit, we are about to get out there. But, you guys know, if you are fans of this channel, that I'm... My point-and-shoot camera had some issues so well we sent it back to sony so they could repair it replace it and it is coming back tomorrow we do not know if they replaced it or repaired it we don't know yet but they are sending it back no matter what maybe it's a new one maybe it's the same one repaired maybe they didn't do anything to it if they didn't do anything to it i'm switching the cannon because I've had nothing but trouble with Sony. I mean, listen to this. That's from me tapping the lens one time. But you guys also know we have a RC monster truck or a truck, and we fixed that too. When I went and bought the drift tires, we went and bought the part for it, and we, we fixed it. We got it back on there. We actually made a homemade wheelie bar for the back of it, and it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. I mean, technically it's my dad's truck, but we both use it. We both have fun with it. But, yeah. I don't know what else to say now. Let's go down to the garage. <laughs> so, we are out here. The battery is charging. I got some error codes on that, but we fixed it. Or it fixed itself, rather. But here's the car. It's still got these wheels on it, but here are the drift tires right here drift tires man boom so um, when the batteries charge we are going to put them on here we'll do like a swapping montage thing and then we'll we'll go and drift around excuse me I'm vlogging but here's the hodgepodge wheelie bar it's basically just bolted into the bottom and it it's not safe really but we did it anyway because it's fun and yeah so if we go under it we can see there's the fixed part the white part right there we, that is the brand new part and somewhere yeah right here right here is the broken part so it's like a fidget spinner but all weird cool hey guys um battery charged battery charged yay it took a while I kept getting air codes but we're gonna go out because it look, maybe looks like it's gonna storm. It's getting windy out, so let let let's go really quickly. Okay, let's go. Okay, the drift tires are on. Drift tires, yay! Okay, I'm gonna set you in the grass. And then there's a spider there, so I'm not gonna set you there. We're gonna set you over here. Sorry for the wind. Yay.
I'm stuck on grass. I broke it again. I broke it again. Yeah, I did. I did it. It's it's my fault. At least you're consistent. Yeah, okay. It is not the car's fault. I was running it. I was constantly I was going down this strip, turning around, coming back, hitting the brakes, turning around. You know, I was repeating and repeating and I burn out the servo. So we're gonna have to unscrew it find out what number it is, and then go to the hobby store and buy another one. I'm amazing. And I, I know you guys like the RC videos, that's why I'm trying to get the parts now. And I might as well buy five of each extra part that I could break. Because let's face it, it's gonna happen. Okay, okay, so we just went in there, we bought a new servo, not exactly tracks his brand, but hopefully oh, I can, you know, it'll work. And then we went in there, we compared everything, same number, same size, and the, you know, so if it doesn't work, I'll be surprised, but we could probably bring it back and get almost our full money because it'll never be used. So that's good. But that's also bad, we're in the Sorrento again. Thanks, Dad. Well, Mr. Guy that works in Hobby Town in Gahanna that works there on Mondays, I don't like you that much because you assured us it would work no nope <sighs> to be continued